Please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering concepts. In this video lecture, I will explain you how to import the structure from StatPro software to an eTap software. And at the same time, I will explain you how to import the structure from eTap software to StatPro software. Okay. So this is also one of the most important uh, concept. Most of the people are asking me to importing process from the eTap software to StatPro software. So initially, I will create the model in StatPro software. So for that, go to StatPro VI software here. So click on the new project option here, select the spacing option, just I am giving the structure, let us consider G plus 5, just I am taking and select your folder as per your consideration, just I am randomly considering this uh, high folder for example, okay, so click on OK option, so select the length units will be in meter as well as force units will be in kilo newton, click on next button, okay, so click on S option, click on finish option. So after that we have to model the structure, so further go to geometry option, click on the run structure wizard option. So in this I am selecting the frame models option, select the bay frame option. So here I am entering the length of the building will be consisting of 14 meter and height of the structure will be consisting of 18 and width of the building is 10 meter just I am taking and number of base along length direction just I am taking here as 4 and this is 6 and this is let us consider here as 3. Okay. So now I am entering this respected distance for the 4 base in length direction. So randomly just I am taking the first value will be of 3 and second value will be of 4 and third value will be of 3 and fourth value will be of 4. Click on OK. So again in the same process for the width direction distance just I am entering the distance. First bay length will be of 3, second bay length will be of 4 and third bay length will be of 3. Click on OK option, click on apply option. Okay. So this is the uh, building structural model which is developed in uh, structure wizard option. So initially we need to Cancel this, click on S option, click on OK. So that the model will be directly imported to uh, your respective Statro software. Okay. After modeling process completed, we need to give the properties for the structure. So further go to geometry. So select the property option, select the define option. Initially, I am selecting the rectangular section which is consisting of 0.46 cross 0.23 for the beam size, sorry column size. Again, I am taking 0.3 cross 0.23 for the beam size. So, select your 0.46 cross 0.23. Go to select option. We need to assign for the beams parallel to Y condition system. Why? Because we have to assign this property to the vertical direction. Click on assign option, click on S option. In the same process, just I am selecting the beams. Go to select option beams parallel to x direction condition, go to select option, beams parallel to z condition system. Click on assign to selected beams option, assign option, yes option. So that it will uh, assign your respected property. So after that we have to select the support condition system, click on create option, add your fixed support, select your support to condition, select the front view option. Now we have to select all the node points from the base. Click on assign to selected nodes, assign option, yes option. So after that we have to see this model in rendering view. So for that go to click on this uh, 3D rendering view option. Okay. So select your respected model. Again you have to click on this 3D rendering view. Okay. So this is the 3D rendering view for this respective structure which is consisting of 0.46 cross 0.23 is the column size and 0.3 cross 0.23 is the beam size. Now we have to import this model from Start Pro software to eTap software. This is the first concept of our video. Okay. So before that initially we need to save this model. Click on save option. So here I am cancelling this uh, Start Pro software. So click on open your high folders so that it will open your files here like this. Okay. So initially I am opening the eTap software here. I have eTap's version 18. Just I am selecting here. Uh, the software will be open here like this. So initially we have to select the file option here. So in this we have to select the import option. So in this import option it will be consisting of etaps.2, uh, k2 and etaps file database and reward architecture dx file format and CSI step 2 file format and structure which is related to stad and stud here like this. So you can select this uh, stad and stud option here initially for opening the model from the stadpro software to etap software. So it will ask you to read the file. So initially we have to click on this read file option so that it will directly take your respected uh, file location so i was located this file in desktop in high folder so initially i am selecting g plus 5 stat model click on open option okay so it will ask you to convert the data so click on the convert data so that it will convert your respected data as per the consideration click on ok option so click on ok option again Again in the same process, uh, it will load your respected conversion process for the G plus uh, 5 structural model which is related to the 18 meter height building. So now you can see here initially we have to click on OK option. So that it will load your uh, G plus 5 structural model which is imported from StatPro software to eTap software. So it will ask you to save the uh, EDB file. So this EDB file was developed in eTap software only. Okay. The format of the file which is saved as per the eTap software, we have to use as EDB only. Click on save option. 
so that it will save your edb file for the structure now you can see this is the structural model which is imported from stat plus software to etap software okay so initially i will show you the properties go to define option section properties frame section so it will be consisting of stat1 section stat2 select the stat1 section click on modify property now you can see this is the property which is related to the column which is having the dimensions is 0.46 cross 230 okay so click on the cancel option again i am selecting start post section 2 click on the modify property it will be consisting of 0.3 cross 0.23 okay so now we have to import this respected etaps uh, file to the start post software okay so this is the alternative method for the uh, start to etaps okay so for that we have to initially save the cis file format okay so for that go to file option here so in this it will be consisting of export option okay so in the export option also it is consisting of etaps dot 2k x file and database and access text xml file and ddb and safe version structure dot x etc etc here like this okay so initially from this respected inputted value we need to take cis two step file format only so here i am selecting this file format so here we have to select the property as per our consideration so you can modify applied uh, loads export option here export member uh, load only export element load only you can consider as per your requirement so for this respected model of g plus 5 i was not uh, assigned any kind of the load cases for the structure so that's why just i am taking do not export apply loads okay so after that we have to select the other export options okay so in this we have to select the export beams end and of set as a uh, joint offset you can select here as per your consideration again you can consider the file units here okay so it will be consisting of newton mm so you can consider here as kilo newton meter okay so after that you have to click on ok option okay so that it will save your respected export c is file for your respected folder okay depends upon that respected file format only you have to export that file to start software so now we can see it is having cis two step file export completed here you can click on ok option so after that we have to go to the start software so here i am selecting start pro vi software here so click on the new project option select the spacing option select the structure name you can consider any one of this and is length units will be in meter kilo newton click on next option click on finish option so after entering into your respective start plus software go to file option here in this it will be consisting of import option here like this so select the import option and from this respected import option we need to select the create new model from csi and slash 2 model okay so this is the important uh, for exporting the file from the etap software to start plus software okay so click on import option so it will open your respected section here like this so it will be consisting of g plus 5 stp file it will be directly open here like this so you can select that file click on open option so it will open your one dialog box here for exporting importing the file from the etap software to uh, start pro software so you can click on the import option model directly okay so that it will load your respected uh, model from the uh, imported file of etap software to start pro software so after that we have to click on the close option so initially you need to click on this 3d model okay now i will show you this model in rendering view click on the 3d rendering view option so now we can see this is the 3d rendering view for this respected structure which is consisting of 0.46 cross 0.23 beam size sorry column size 0.46 cross 0.23 column size and 0.3 cross 0.23 is the beam size for this structure okay so you can check the properties for this uh, building section so it will be consisting of your properties like beam size of 0.3 cross 0.23 and column size of 0.4 cross 0.23 okay so this is the complete process importing the uh, structure from the Start plus software to etap software at the same time etap software to start plus software if you have any queries about this respected video please text me your questions in the below comment box i will clarify your respected doubts thank you